So this will be the most randomest shit I'll ever do in my life. For the first time in my life, I'm gonna go on a staycation on my own. I kind of want to like spend some time on my own and see where my mind takes me and see if I can actually survive a night on my own outside of my own house. Staycation seems like something that a lot of people like to do, especially with their loved ones and their family members. Since I don't have my family out here, I don't have no loved ones out here. I'm gonna go on a stay va stay vacant. Stay vacant. Stay vacation. Staycation. Staycation on my own and uh, it's Saturday. I'm gonna go have some fun. I hope. Pack a bag for no reason. I don't actually have to pack a bag. Literally only gonna stay for less than 24 hours and I'm gonna stay there. Normally, um, on a daily basis, I'm a very boring ass person. When I rest, I don't rest actually. I just always think about work, maybe editing, filming some TikToks, or drawing some stuff for the next project. So let's see what happens today. I cannot tell you how excited I actually am for this staycation. It's my first time kind of like splurging myself. I've never spent money on myself. Do you know what I mean? Let's just go. What the hell am I saying? I'm wasting so much time. A few moments later. You get high and don't on the regular. I can't be beautiful like a teenager. Hi guys. So I am at the hotel room. It's not anything bougie, it's just perfect for one 24 years old lady who lonely and want to have some time to think about her life and shit. Today, the plan is to maybe fix some songs that I've been help writing and also edit some vlog, think of some content to do, draw some stuff for Chonosaurus tonight, so that's the agenda for today. I'm very sensitive with view. Now that I live alone, I realize that the amount of light and view I get from my window shades are so important. So what I got, I got this specific view. There were two different types of views that they offered me. So they offered me the city view or the park view. So I chose the park obviously because I love green. And this is what I'm seeing. La -la! Nothing bougie, but very like soothing, you know what I mean? I specifically chose this place because there's this dim sum place that I really like called Tim Ho Wan that does deliveries here because Tim Ho Wan is located on this side of Seoul. They don't do deliveries to my place. I was gonna be bougie, order some dim sum at a hotel room and work on my stuff by myself and just chill and groove. I don't know what I'll be doing, but I'm just enjoying the fucking view. God, I wish I woke up every day like, you know, can't wake up every day and be like, hi, hello world, hello humans, and be like, wow. A few moments later. Debating whether I should delete my, not delete, I mean, erase my makeup and just actually chill or should I pretend to still have this makeup on and do my thing so that you guys have something pretty to look at or should I just be in my natural face I really want to be in my natural face though because today is my staycation it's on my staycation it's my staycation a few moments later <laughs> I feel like I should wash my makeup and then order food. No, let's order food right now. I don't care if I look like a bum, my hair looks like a mess. I don't care if I'm gonna wear sunglasses in this room on my own. Who's gonna judge me? Uh, today I felt like I was in a good mood so I decided to order some food from my friend She got her vaccine yesterday and I wanted to kind of cheer her up I ordered her some food so she had food right when she went home um, The food was delivered on 
the right time because I calculated everything. So when she got home, she went to her front door and the food was there. I ordered some really good Mexican food that she really wanted. And yeah, I felt like giving today. So I decided to just give her some food so that she can have a great Saturday night. You know what I've learned recently? I've learned in life not to put my happiness on other people. Because my personality, I'm a giving person. I gain happiness from helping other people more than helping myself. But I feel like I've been doing that too much to people who don't give me the same thing back. And I've been trying to fix that. The most important thing I learned is to be more independent, to be happy by myself on my own not having to look for friends to hang out with every single day I know it's normal for some people to hang out with people every single day but for me, I feel like as a human being you need to learn how to be alone on your own those people who try to like reach out to people, hang out with people okay, for me, I feel like there's two different types of reason one reason might be business-wise you're trying to connect with this person because business level-wise you know, there's something you for both of you to gain from that relationship, I do completely understand that. That's how networking and everything works. But people who just meet whoever and see whoever on a daily basis for no reason, almost want to ask them like, bro, how do you, how, do you have fun by yourself? Have you ever had a day where you spend completely 100% by your own, not talking to anyone, not texting anyone, not seeing anyone? Like, have you ever lived that life before? Because I feel like that's the life that every independent human being should know how to live. And I was doing that for a little while and then just lost track of it. And now I'm trying to come back to the base. Come back to who I was before. <sighs> Being a doll is fucking hard. Like changing your perspective, no one can make you change your perspective unless you change it yourself. It's easy said than done. All I want to say to you beautiful human beings out there is if you are on this journey to try to find yourself, be happy with your own skin and be happy with having this time and space on your own. I know it's super hard. I am going through the same shit that you are going through. So if you feel ever feel lonely or you feel like, is this normal? Is this something every human go through and stuff like that? Just know that Yes, it's something that everyone goes through, it's something that I go through on a daily basis. I don't know how I came to this conversation. What I was trying to do in the first place was just order some dim sum. But yeah, let's see. Tim Ho Mua. If they don't do delivery today, I'm gonna be so. Oh, they do. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna be me from now on, but I feel like this is, has always been me, but I have decided to publicly announce that this is what I am this is what I always has been and I am comfortably going to show this to y'all if you guys are open to this whatever the heck is going on I'm gonna get baked BBQ pork buns shrimp dumpling oof Pork dumplings in hot and spicy sauce. Shrimp rice roll. Mm -hmm. Should I get seasonal veggies or water spinach? I'm gonna get water spinach. Um, baked barbecue pork buns, three pieces. Shrimp dumplings, three pieces. Pork dumplings in hot and spicy sauce, three pieces. Three pieces. Three pieces. Shrimp rice rolls, three pieces. Water spinach. Take that! <gasps> 44 minutes, 44 minutes, 44 minutes, the food is coming. 44 minutes at 40, 40, 40, 40. Ah. Oh, now it's 43 minutes, eh? 43 minutes, eh? 43. I have 42 minutes to work on a vlog. The problem is, I will have to take the memory card out of this camera. Let's do that first. Bye guys. Don't know what to say, but food is here. I'm so hungry. My stomach was just growling like crazy. They didn't give me chopsticks. I got all of these. But no fucking no. Oh no. What do I do? 
네 여보세요 혹시 저 젓가락이 없어가지고 혹시 있으세요? 어? 저 하나만 주시면 안 될까요? <웃음> 네. 아, 네, 감사합니다. 미달. I think I'm a very fun person when I'm alone. I guess this is what I needed. You know? Oh my! Little dim sums. Uh. What else do we got here? Well, we wait for a chopstick. We wait for a chopstick. Hey, we wait for a chopstick. Hey, we wait. We wait. Veggies. So I can go to the bathroom later. Oh, no, 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 no. We got pork. Um, I don't know what it's called, but it's great. Bro. This with spicy sauce that they given me here. Oh. My dude. Oh! Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Why am I having so much fun by myself? I do not get this at all. This is the opposite of what I had in my head. I thought I would be like sad and cry and like I'm the actual opposite. I am having the time of my life. And I never felt this way before And I only know to you Why do I keep remixing every song I hear? Mukbang! A fairy tour for the holidays this year There's no Hanukkah fairy He goes under your pillow and spins a dreidel And then he goes <laughs> Really bad But don't worry about it Things only get marginally worse <laughs> Still tripping around Still falling on their faces But now we have neck bones. Now we have neck bones. There's a cooking coming. I don't have a name for my penis. I'll name yours and you name mine. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so mm. much pressure. Mm. That was everything but the kitchen sink. Wow. Oh, but that was the kitchen sink! sink. <laughs> Not it's so box. hard to find these in Korea. I cannot eyes. believe I'm eating be this. Glowing. Oh, all right. Here we have. Mm. Okay. This one is a little bit long-winded, but please trust me and stay with me. For those of you that watched our look at this, look at this, when look you this. still want to secretly give your great grandchildren money nah. because of the pandemic. <laughs> oh my! No, 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 no. Dude, no, no, no. I live for this. <laughs> So sweet. That's like honestly. Just as cross. <laughs> <laughs> just as cross. What? That's the dog. Yeah, it looks like a, like a shoe bag. You tie it back. I mean, there's. That's like a human screaming that they're about to get murdered. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that remind me of your mom? Because it, it, that's like something that my mom does. <laughs> Another thing I have to accomplish today is a bit of work. I'm working on a song right now and I have to send back ideas to my producers. I'm filming TikToks now. I don't know how I ended up here, but I'm gonna do this. You can dance, you can drive Having the time of your life Ooh, see that girl, oh, watch that scene She is <laughs> You can dance, you can drive Having the time of your life Ooh, see that girl, oh, watch that scene <laughs> Fail. Don't you know that I choose you over anybody else? When you're not around, it's just bad for my health. I'm good on my own, but when you I'm someone else, you're telling me to choose up, but I already choose you. Just finished with the song, filmed two TikToks, about to knock the fuck out. Just got so tired. I think I danced too much today. Is that why? I'm trying to meet your mama on a Sunday 
Now, I'm gonna go shower. Skincare time. While I mask myself, I'm going to read this book that I got from a friend. The Subtle Art of Not Giving a Fuck. I normally don't really read a lot. I'm not really good at reading. For some reason, every time I read a book, I fall asleep and I can't really concentrate. Like, I'm reading, but my, my brain is not really taking in the information. I'm just gonna continue reading this and then wash my face. So after the face mask, I got McDonald's. I got some vanilla, what do you call this? Milkshake? 12 o'clock midnight. As you guys can see, my eye is about to close. So I will end my vlog here. I will go to sleep and uh, good night. Hope y'all had fun, because I had fun. Bye.